Hey everybody, how's life treating you? I'm Russ Robo, and welcome back to uh, Ultra Modded Skyrim. Sorry it's been so long, I had to make some changes and adjustments. I'm using the, um, the actual, like, Nikon Coolpix camera now, so, like, I hope it actually works. Because the webcam was nice and all, but, uh, the, the lag and the, and the not, um, the not synchronizing as I described you earlier. All that good stuff. Yes, sorry it has been so long, but we are back on Zatanna. I'm pushing this door open. I have myself a plan. I want to figure out what all those mods are about. Uh, they all, without shelter, the heat feels distance, getting colder. Oh crap, I'm already... No! No! Must run, must run. Okay, okay, okay. Can I get like a... Oh, blast it. A torch or an umbrella or something. I can't get an umbrella. I mean, how do I just shut off the rain? Can't shut off the rain. That's cheating. That's using a cheat code. That's not the same. Uh, my basic plan was to go uh, kill that first dragon. Uh, they ju I just went through the task where they told us about it. Um, that it's outside the watchtower. There we go. Gimme. Um, I was gonna, in order to take it down so that I could get a house. I need a, I need a house to store all my crap. I'm getting too much stuff. So I was gonna go on ahead and take that out. Did I, did I get any ranged spells? I meant to buy some ranged uh, spells. Let's see, magic. I always jump instead of activate my magic. Why the heck do I do that? Uh, destruction. That's, oh god, I was supposed to get ranged spells from, ah, uh, forget it. The guards pretty much take them out for you anyway. Or I could use my bow and arrows. Let's see, what kind of good bow and arrows do I have? Stop doing that! items. Let's see. And now the dogs are barking. That's great. Orcish bow. We can use that. We might as well be good at everything. The only problem is, like, the cold. I, I don't know how to cope with the cold. Uh, I bought a small, with my monies, I bought a small, um, what do you call it, uh, camping set to replace the one that I burned down. Um, I bought a few potions, I spent the night in an inn, and I basically kept buying and selling potions and arrows and armor and ingredients and all kinds of stuff until uh, I made it to level 4. We must run. And put the bow away because running will be faster without an, without an equipped weapon. I'm not going to worry about um, any plants along the way. I just want to hurry up and get there to the dragon. Endurance perk available. Moderately fatigued. Huh. So, fatigued. Uh, I haven't slept in a while. Dang, blasted. Can this fire heat me up? Flame? Flame a little bit? Let's see now. Maybe destruction magic. Like use, I've, I've tried that already. Destruction magic. Using my flames to heat myself up. <laughs> the, uh, the sad part is, oh, that's another thing that happened to me. Uh, I didn't uh, get the chance to record, is I actually, I've passed out from hypothermia. You pass out and you wake up, um, where did I wake up at? I think I just woke up, hmm, I think I just woke up uh, in the nearest inn, which was in um, Riverwood. It said some traveler found me on the road. Okay. I just, I want to get this guy down because I need a house to store my goods. But then again, I still need the money to buy the house. I don't know if I even have the money. Let's go, let's do this. If it would ever just stop raining. I could get some shelter by going in the tower, perhaps. That's what I plan on doing. I'm gonna go in the tower and just take pot shots from that opening right there. That way I can see now. I have to think. Uh, had to think. I have to think strategically on where not only can I fight um, well enough to actually deal damage, but also to have shelter from the friggin' elements because it doesn't stop raining. And why is it raining through the top of the roof? Why? Why it do that? It shouldn't do that. There's a roof there. 
You are drenched. No shit, Sherlock. Oh well. Let's do this. Oh god, I haven't used a bow in so long. Ah, uh, the buttons are backwards. I must fix them. No, why is it taking? It's up. Oh. Hey there, big fella. It, oh, no, he's gonna fly away. And I missed him. Oh my god, it's taking so much of my stamina just to draw the blast bow. <laughs> and it's difficult to see him through the smoke. That must be the point of it. Where'd he go? I'm drenched anyway. I might as well go to the top of the tower. I may be drenched, but as, little, as long as I'm not in a in super cold area, it'll help me a lot. Where'd he go? Where the... Where the f*** are you? I'm not afraid. Is he already down on the ground? You are feeling a bit thirsty. You are drenched. I don't care! There's a dragon. There's a dragon. He's gonna die without me being able to even fight him. Oh god. You are completely dry. <laughs> he lit me on fire. Oh god. It's so hard to aim with this thing. Oh god, no, no, no. We're gonna back out. We're, we're gonna nope. We're gonna nope out of that one. Fortify, oh god, do I have any just straight healing? Oh boy, uh, I need resist fire. Wait, oh god, what was the other effect of that? I didn't read it. Ow, 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 get away from all the flame, get away from all the flame. I'm still on fire, crap. Okay, I could definitely use healing hands to heal myself. That's a new factor, getting completely dry by being burnt alive. Finally. Clear shot. Okay, I got him that time. Oh, crap. And I can't reach him. He's down. Oh, boy. Yeah, if you if you just wait long enough, the guards pretty much take him by himself. By themselves. It's a nightmare. Man, I am not good with this controller setup. I might have to switch back to keyboard and mouse. I can't hit the broad side of a barn. It was different on the PS4, or uh, on the PS3, the controls seem either more sensitive or less sensitive. Maybe I need to fix that. But anyway, it's time to absor uh, absorb a dragon soul. Can't even hear anything through all the frickin' rain. That's one thing about this wet <clears throat> weather mod is I think it's just going to be raining constantly. And of course, I absorbed a dragon soul. No big deal. Nothing to freak out about. Dragon bones and scales. Okay, so I wasn't quite as over encumbered as I thought I was. In fact, I wasn't even over encumbered. But then again, I knew I still need. Hey, yeah, I hit him once. Ancient Nord arrow. <laughs> Use the shout section of the magic menu to equip your unrelenting force shout. And of course I may have hit him more than once, because you know the odds of you getting back an arrow after you fired it are like one in three. You are Dragonborn. Yeah, yeah, the yeah. Very oldest tales, back from when there were still dragons in Skyrim. The Dragonborn would slay dragons and steal their power. That's what you did, isn't it? Absorb the Oh, that power. reminds me, I actually need to go into the settings and turn the music all the way down. Uh, the last episode I had and I'm sorry I'm interrupting him and speaking right over him, but uh, I'm pretty sure you guys know this part by now. Um, what was it? Um, I was thinking of a thing. Oh yeah, I need to turn the music all the way down because the last episode I had, uh, it got, um, it got a strike against it, which I'm not necessarily in any trouble for that. It's just that, you know, there there's an advertisement somewhere on the video, and it's going towards the developers of or the owners of the song that was in the game. Which, you know, I mean, that's fine and all. That's fine, it's just, uh... Let's see, Master Effects. Effects, is effects rain? Because rain is kind of loud right now. Basically, it, it's a commercial on the last video that I'm not... I don't mind me not getting any money, it's just, like... I, I don't know, it's, it's just a commercial. I don't know if people want to hear that. Footsteps up. Let's no, let nobody sneak up on me. Voice up. Music. Way old down. Interior rain. You know. Ah, okay, yeah. 
A little, a little drizzle. A little drizzle. Lighting effects. Oh, lightning. Ooh, that's cool. Lightning and rain. Into, uh, lightning. Loud ass lightning. Uh, master volume effects. Footsteps. That, that sounds fine. I'm good with all that. I'm good with all that. Tell stories about the dragon boy. Those born with the dragon blood. Well, I don't know if anything in that tower would count as interior rain, since it seemed to... Whoa, what the heck? You are wet. No, no shit, Sherlock. Um, let's, uh, let's, uh, carry on, shall we? What we need to do right now... You are feeling moderately fatigued, so quite getting a bit fatigued. Oh yeah, I gotta shout at him. Unrelenting force. Uh, oh, it already it already did it for me. A bit hungry. RT to shout. Foos. Oh, it was optional. I didn't even have to hit him with it. Okay. I really gotta switch those buttons around. And I need to get better at um, aiming with the controller. I don't know. Maybe I need to put up the sensi uh, sensitivity. Sorry, I keep whipping it around. <laughs> Can't get it. But, uh, god dang, this fucking rain, is it never going to end? You feel comfortable. Oh, oh boy, I hope, I would hope I feel comfortable after just slaying a freaking dragon. Well, then again, they, they slew the dragon. They slew the dragon. Definitely not, that'll be the only dragon fight that's going to be like that, because they basically hold your hand for the first one. And all the other ones, it's just me, by myself, or me and a follower, if I happen to have a follower. Which, I actually want to go get that guy. Because he's kind of important. He's like, um, one of the major mods that I installed. Just picking up some flowers along the way. <laughs> but I gotta go talk to the Jarl. I need that house bad. I don't even need it to be fully furnished. I just want it to be there and to be something that I can up oh, the graybeards they call me <laughs> I'm more interested in the mods that's why I knew that the first couple of episodes are going to be a little bit um, not necessarily difficult but I feel like I'm on a time crunch you know well I've got to get through all the regular uh, standard vanilla stuff to get to the mods that I installed which I bet you I can get to the mods already, I just feel a little bit more comfortable leveling up first and at least having a house to store items. And man, oh man, my uh, mage character is squishy. Running takes stamina, pulling the bow takes stamina, everything takes stamina. Some of that might be to do with the mods, or maybe I just haven't played a character this squishy in a while. <laughs> I cannot wait to get inside and get away from all this rain. It's not permanently set to rain, is it? been raining forever. <sighs> I bet it just rains all day. Or it rains until you decide to like hit the wait button. I could probably wait like an hour. The clouds part as the rain passes on. <laughs> oh god. Oh I love the way they put that out there. Oh, as the rain passes on, it's like a it's it's like a passage from the Bible. Get out of my way, guard! I was just saying about how the rain just seems to last forever, and it finally stops. Thank goodness. You gotta do what you gotta do. Anyway. I need to talk to the Jarl's steward, or just the Jarl himself, in order to turn in that quest. Turning in quests feels less like Skyrim and more like a, a different kind of RPG. <laughs> Definitely looks nice though, it's just nice to not have the rain around so often. Forever and ever with the rain. Jeez. And it's actually kind of funny, because now we don't get to hear the, um... Well, I was going to say now we don't get to hear the interior rain effects, but the rain will be back, I'm sure. 
Good. You're finally here. The Yarl's been waiting no for you. No shit, Sherlock. You heard the sun. So what happened at the Watchtower? We killed the dragon. Was the dragon there? Watchtower was destroyed, but we killed the dragon. I knew I could count on Irileth. Uh, Absorb Sunga, a kind of power so from it's it. It's true. The Greybeards really were summoning you. The Greybeards? Who the heck are they? of the way of the voice. They live in seclusion, high on the slopes of the throat of the world. The Dragonborn is said to be uniquely gifted in the voice. The ability to focus your vital essence into a thume or shout. Completely if dry, you thank really goodness. Are dragonborn, they can teach you how to use your gift. The Grey Bears. You begin to warm up. Didn't you awesome. hear the thundering sound as you returned to Whiterun? That was the voice of the Greybeards, summoning you to High Rothgar. Yeah, this hasn't happened might go centuries, later. At least. Not since Tiber Septim himself was summoned when he was still Talos of Atmora. Rangar, calm yourself. What does any of this Nord nonsense have to do with our friend here? Capable as she may be, I don't see any signs of her being this, what, dragonborn. Nord nonsense? Why, you puffed up ignorant. These are our sacred traditions that go ignorant. back to the founding of the First Empire. Rongar, don't be so hard on Avanichi. I meant no disrespect, of course. It's just Me. that, what do these greybeards want with her? That's the Greybeards. You've done a great service for Okay, me now we can get onto the Dragon house, right? By my right is Jarl. Next, I name you Thane of yes, Run. finally Thane. It's the greatest honor that's within my power to grant. I assign you Lydia as a personal house car, And this weapon from my armory to serve as your badge yeah. of office. I'll also notify my guards. I think what I'm going to do is... I know for a fact that um, that character I downloaded for the follower with all those different uh, thousands of lines of text, I know he's in the jail in Riften. I can go there and pick him up and use Lydia to help me since I'm such a low level. Then I can dismiss Lydia, get him, and the two of us can go straight to the college in Winterhold to find out all those new spells. There's no refusing the summons of the Greybeards. I think that might work out. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. I envy you, you know. Oh. To climb the seven thousand steps again. I know. I've heard it a thousand times. When you've made four different characters and you have like a thousand hours in the game, you've heard it a million times. Very disconnected from the troubles of this world. I wonder that the Greybeards even notice what's going on down here. They haven't seemed to care before. Should I? No matter. Go to High Hrothgar. Learn what the Greybeards Good God, teach. he goes on forever. Back to business, Proventus. Yeah, business. You still have a city to As in defend. the business of selling me I my house. What does it mean? I'd like to purchase true. a house in the city. Five grand. I don't think I have that kind of money. Yes, my lord. Oh, oh, no, 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 not the bow. I always pick the wrong friggin' thing, and then I choose jump. It's B. For the love of Christ, it's B. Why, why do I always... Um... Who? Five grand. <sighs> it's gonna be a while. Lydia, come with me. We need to go get a new follower. And you're gonna hold a bunch of dragon bones and scales. Wait, no, I'm gonna dismiss her, so maybe I shouldn't have her hold those. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Jarl has appointed me to be your house, Carl. Follow me, I need your help. Lead the way. <laughs> Got a better looking face now since the mods I installed. Uh, we are going to now see they already put that quest on my uh, on my um, on my itinerary, but no. These are the new quests, the ones that lead to uh, some of the DLC I downloaded. Well, I just don't know which ones are which. Note from Bulgear, Bear Claw should read it, find out in Thursdays, this is this with. Read the note. Oh, that, that's easy. Uh, I just have to read a note on that one. I mean, of oh course, inventory for the love of Christ. Note, note, books. Anonymous letter, bounty, letter from Bulgear, Bear Claw. Let's read it, find out. Completed. Read, read the note from Bulgir Bill. Find ne the necromancer and the strange creatures. Oh, is that how I raise my army of the undead? 
Friend, we seek your aid. A dark necromancer has been attacking innocents along the northern coast, accompanied by strange creatures who do his every bidding. I trust you can help us with this troublesome matter and investigate on our behalf. Yay! Um, let's get our follower and then do it? Yes. Our true follower. Not Lydia. Lydia's great and all. Love her to death, but she's not, she's not what I'm looking for. Also, I'm also wondering, where do I go about the process of getting torches? Or should I just buy one from the general merchant? Because, I mean, I think torches would help keep me warmer, too. I also don't know the, um... I don't know the, uh... I mean, I can look up the warmth and coverage on my clothing, but it's not much. Mine. Yeah, we'll go the short way. Can't be looking for plants right now. Without shelter, the heat feels distant. Getting colder. Oh, yeah, because the sun is down. Crud. I still need that torch. Uh, and I don't have a place to sleep. Unless I want it to be in an inn. Actually, I probably should do that. We're going to rest for the night. Yeah, because I'm thirsty, hungry, haven't had sleep. I'm thirsty, hungry, tired, cold. Wow. Not good at taking care of myself, apparently. But we're going to sleep for the night, and then I'm going to split the video and start a new one. Welcome. After Let me know if you I want get anything. what I need. <laughs> I think I got the clean mug around this is here somewhere. But at least I have enough uh, money to get I enjoy this in, work well enough, like rooms. But I'm ready to retire. I've been thinking of selling the inn to Isolda. Oh yeah, anyway, I can help with that if I want. Selling the inn and stuff. Uh, let's see. Take a look. I, I'm, I'm curious as to why the option for um, learn more about magic was available. That's that's odd, because I'm pretty sure I already know about... I'm pretty sure this character already knows about the College of Winterhold. She's got... Oh, I've got 601. Cabbage, egger, cheese wedge. Garlic, ooh. Uh, should I try to make something? Green apples, grilled leeks, honey nut treat, horker loaf. Was that... Is that cooked? I don't think that's cooked. Meat pie! That's what we need. Raw beef, salmon steak, salt pile. I could try to cook something. Woo! No, not that many. How about two? Let's see. Venison. Venison. And are those... Let's see. Three, three of three. I don't think I need that. And some wine. Let's see if we can cook something. I'd like to rent a room. Sure thing. It's yours okay, for Okay, so day. now all I have to do is eat and drink. And see if I can cook room, something. Right way. Hey, because I need because to use that spit. Works. Get off it. Exactly. Oh, Cooking spit. Someone else is using this. Not anymore. Pardon me, I know it's rude. I'm sorry. I can make a thing. Cabbage, uh, cabbage soup. A leg of goat roast. Pheasant roast. That, well, that's the thing. I like making soups and stews instead of uh, uh, just the cook of meat. Because the cook of meat is just the meat and then you cook it. That's it. So let's make some cabbage soup. One salt pile and one cabbage. Yay! Oh, there was a miscellaneous option. What the heck was that? Was that uh, something other than food? Poison... Oh! Poison green apple and poison red apple. Causes four points of poison damage for 60 seconds. Uh, that's part of a mod, I think. What do you pick up there? It'll... Oh, I wish I saw that first. You're so lucky. Do I? Anyway, that, um, it's part of a mod that allows me to put the poisoned apples in someone's inventory. If I can sneak it into there <laughs> and poison them like Snow White. Uh, let's see, it's B. Okay, yeah, I'm finally getting used to it. We need food. Let's drink some wine. Take our cabbage stew and some, uh, water. Uh, that's for dessert. See, see, I even get to think about it. I even get to think about it. That's so cool. We can use our imagination. Like, real RPGing. Where's my cabbage soup? I passed it. Um, yummy. Uh, it doesn't say I'm well fed yet, so... Uh, meat. Ought to have a... Yeah, we'll, feeling well sated. It's uh, like you gotta have a, um... A protein. So you got your main, and then you got your protein. All right, water skin empty. And then we drink these ones, and it should say well hydrated. Excellent. Oh, we forgot dessert. 
<laughs> uh, let's see. Wine and honey nut treat. Oh, man. You guys getting hungry watching that? That's good. Just all <laughs> picturing it. That's so good. Okay, so now it actually is nighttime, so it's a good time for sleeping. Uh, 8.30 or 8.40 p.m. in Skyrim time. So we're going to go for 8, 9, 10, 11. Wait, no. It always starts off. So 9, 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, waking up at 5 a.m. Nice, nice. Okay. While that's going on, I'll split. Uh, I'll keep this recording going on the computer. And I'll split this camera because it says it has two minutes before it shuts down. Wake feeling re a bit hungry. Jesus Christ, I just ate. It's been eight hours. Oh, great. So don't eat before bed. Now we figured that out. Actually, that's good advice for life as well. Okay, and I'll split this off here. All right, folks. We're back. It's still the same recording. I just had to hit the pause button because for some reason this camera only wants to record for about 30 minutes before it automatically shuts off. But it's, even though it's not as reliable as my webcam, it is, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Um, less strain on the PC, if you will. I've got food with me. I've got water with me. I think we're good to go. I also have a decent amount of money, so I might be able to buy something. But what would I want to buy? I need a range spell. Let's see if the general uh, general merchant... God bless America! Oh, that's right. I only slept till 5 a.m. I need something ranged. I guess I'll just stick with my bow for now, even though I can't hit the broad side of the barn. I'm in a hurry. I am, I am wanting to go. So we are going to... Ooh, maybe I should buy a horse with my winnings. You oh, there. great. These guys. We're looking for someone in White Run. We'll pay good money for information. Yada, 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 yada. A woman, a foreigner in these lands. Redguard, like us. She is likely not using her true name. We will pay for any information I am not turning her in. I did we that on one account and I felt White terrible for it. So we will be in Rorikstead if you learn anything. You will be in my way. If you locate her, find us in Rorikstead. Okay, I'm still going after the necromancer, right? I want to go get... Uh, I've got to remember his name. See, I'm getting his name mixed up with my D&D &D character, Rin Mati, who is um, a uh, tabaxi, a tabaxi healer, or a uh, cleric, as you, as it will. Um, he's a tabaxi cleric, which is basically the D&D &D version of Kaijit. Uh, and I'm getting uh, his name mixed up with the DLC character, uh, or the mod character that I downloaded for uh, this frigging game. Thank God it's not raining and it's not snowing either, because it will snow and I will freeze to death. Uh, I could take the carriage to Riften. Should I? I don't know. See, some players are really big about no fast traveling. They hate fast traveling, which I always figured that the carriage is a fair way to do that, because it's not just fast traveling. You know, you're not like cheating. You have to pay for that just like paying for an inn or any other service. Speaking of which, I need to drink some blasted water. Um, like I said before, don't eat before bed. In real life or in this game, apparently. Uh, let's have some baked potatoes. And then for dessert, a boiled creme treat. Aha, well sated. See, I, I timed that out perfectly. And then a water skin. And well hydrated. Excellent, excellent. I guess... Let's go the old-fashioned way. We're low level and we could use the experience from whatever we might encounter on the road. The only problem is, since I'm recording all of this, I, I feel rushed, in a hurry, so to speak. But then again, part of the only reason I feel that way is because I have the camera. What if I shut the camera off and continued walking and just kept the recording going on Bandai Cam? And then... If I encounter anything, I could just, in post, skip to that part, and you could see the fights, and then I could go back. And when we actually get to, um, when we actually get to Riften, then I'll just turn the face cam back on. Hmm. Yep, that's what we're doing. I'll see you there. Okay. 
Um, let's see, how is this going to look from the player's perspective? Oh no, from the viewer's perspective. And I actually like uh, monologuing like this to give you guys an idea on how all this sort of thing goes. Uh, from your perspective, I'm guessing that the face cam just disappeared, which I'm going to do that later in post. Uh, let's see, it is called post, right? Yeah, yeah. Post and pre-recording or something. Um, so, but you're still seeing me picking up all these flowers and whatnot. And I can either skip to any encounters that we might encounter, or I can fast forward it, because I have that option, because I'm a boss. I want to go this way. Because I'm a bowler. So, yeah, that's actually pretty cool. Want to play a fun game? This one's called Kick the Skull. Bap! Wait, where'd it go? Did it not? Oh no, did they fix that glitch? Oh, wow, on the PS3, um, it was glitched so that if your character actually walked over one of these um, skulls, there was a chance that you'd get stuck on it for a second, and then when you got unstuck, it would just kick the skull, like, 20 feet in the air. Oh, there's a kick. Yeah, I can't, I can't glitch kick it anymore. I'm teaching you about all the little... Oh, there it went! There it went! Did you see it? <laughs> Did you see it? Oh, no, jump! Jump, you idiot! Jump! No, why is jump not working? Oh, that's right. Did you see it? Did you see it fly off? Oh, I'm so, I'm so immature. That excited me so much. We've got to try it again. Hang on. I'm sorry. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? You, you know, you know that I'm not lying. It flew, it flew. If we can find it, I can prove it to you. It, it went, like, the, uh, pause the video. You'll see it. It's only on there for, like, a frame, but it was there. For the love of Christ, it was there. Anyway, uh, I guess they tried to fix that glitch, or maybe they didn't. Maybe it's, I bet you it's because it's just the PC version. So it, it's doing better, you know, it's not quite as glitchy. Um, ah, wolf. This is good target practice, actually. And it's also good for me to learn how to use this blasted thing, since I'm kind of sucky at it. Oh, beautiful. Oh, yeah, right in the hip. Yeah, 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 yeah. I figure I... I'm sorry for that laugh. Um, I figure I might as well get used to using it and get good at it. You know, just do a little bit of practice in everything, you know? Um since uh, it just takes so much. It, like, you never know, maybe I'll be out of mana one day and I'll need an arrow. Who knows? I could be an everything sort of character. Which is part it, which is part of the reason why I'm debating on whether or not I should go with the robes and just stick to the alteration um, perk that allows you to have magical armor when you're only wearing robes. Or should I just go full armor and just say to heck with it. Go, go freaking heavy armor or light armor probably put this away before I talk to people who are you yes are you are you part of one of the mods I'm collecting ingredients to bring to the gourmet he'll think my taste so refined when I offer them to him you have heard of the gourmet uh yeah then you know that gourmet keeps his identity a secret I'm hoping to discover who he is so I can tell him how he changed my life for all I know the gourmet is a woman you know I've heard the Gourmet is in Skyrim right now. Interesting. I do know about the Gourmet, but that's... That's a quest that only comes much, much later. Um, I believe, unless I'm mistaken, that quest is from the Dark... Bro oh! Uh, spoiler alerts! Spoiler, uh, spoiler alerts! Um, I'm about to spoil a thing if you guys want to skip ahead maybe mm, two or three minutes. Okay. Now that the spoiler alert alarm has been sounded, uh, unless I'm mistaken, I believe um, I believe the gourmet is a Dark Brotherhood quest line. Oh, oh, get get put on. Yes, <laughs> um, the gourmet. Uh, you have to try to assassinate the current uh, Jarl of. Uh, was it? Uh, hang on, let me let me check my map. Um, okay. Oh God, yes, I know. Oh, and, and my mod, my mod also has the. Do you like the map? The way it looks. How do I zoom? How do I how do I zoom? Why am I not zooming? There we go. The map the map has it. It's it's been increased. It's better now. Uh, yes, solitude. 
uh, the current Jarl of Solitude is the one that's, um, like, the most loyal to the Empire. And in order to stage a coup, um, you know, and, and, like, bring in a lot of, oh, yes, bring in a lot of traffic for the Dark Brotherhood, um, one of their really sneaky, sneaky plans is to point, is to pose as the, um, I need to hurry this up because other people who are um, trying to skip ahead to not be spoiled will be spoiled. Okay, I won't move. I won't move from this spot until I finish the spoiler. Anyway, um, their plan is to assassinate the Jarl um, uh, of Solitude in order to um, basically uh, make a bunch of noise for the Dark Brotherhood. Uh, it doesn't turn out to be the Jarl. It turns out to be a fake. But the way you get to him is by posing as the gourmet and poisoning his food. And that's the spoiler. Uh, okay, we're done. Spoiler is over. Yay! You didn't hear the spoiler because you skipped ahead to this part. Or maybe you heard the spoiler because you already knew about it, so you didn't skip ahead. Woo! <laughs> and you saw me just murder those wolves. I mean, that, those were some good shots. I mean, maybe I was just too finicky with the dragon. I mean, then again... It was dark and it was raining and there was there was sun in my eyes even though it was raining and my glasses were at lens crafter and I'd been slim, swimming in a pool with too much chlorine but I seen that dragon <laughs> yeah it he was hard to hit but man those wolves whew, I just murdered those guys they didn't stand a chance oh I shouldn't have gone this way I just realized what's gonna happen now I'm going to either be forced to either pay the toll or fight off a bunch of bandits in that clearing over there. I just want to go to Riften. I literally just want to go to Riften. Okay, well, I will attempt... Oh, oh, you... S nope, nope, nope. No point blank shots. It's against my way. No oh, crap. Whoopsie. I let the button go. Oh, sh an after-the-fact shot. Yeah, I don't like point-blank shots. It's unrealistic. If you're an archer, you know, you're... Good God, all the blood. Uh, that's another mod I downloaded. Lots of blood. Definitely increased blood volume. Um, if you're an archer, it just seems very unrealistic to have an enemy charging you and then, oh! And then just, all of a sudden, you just pull out a bow and just shoot them point-blank. There's an un another enemy somewhere over here, but I don't see him. See his icon. I'm running out of stamina. Come on there, big fella. Oh, I could have hit that elk. I could do it. Where the heck are you? I'm missing plants, a-hole. Come on, bring it on. I see that there's an enemy on the horizon. You see his red dot? Oh, it must be the elk. The elk registers me as a threat, so I guess we're enemies now. That's sad. Oh, well. Did he die? What the heck killed him? Why'd he die? Oh. Oh, he was registering us as an enemy and we were registering him as an enemy. So Lydia must have shot a lucky arrow at him. Douche. He was just a harmless little deer. Oh well. Better make full use of him. Oh, that's good. That's good. Um, I can make full use of him to honor his sacrifice, just like the, you know, Native Americans. Now I can, like, take the meat and make it into stew and feed myself because, you know, survival mods. Iverstead went to... I just gotta get there. I just wanna get to Riften. What the fudge cakes? Who? Who? Who's hitting me? Oh, wolf. I didn't even see him pop up on me. Whoopsie. Dang, I almost hit her. <laughs> I'm a fucking child. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, when am I gonna grow up? <laughs> never. I'll never get old. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, I'm so sorry. I'm gonna pay the fine. I'm, I just don't. I don't have time to deal with this crap. Go ahead, 
Tell me I can't pass. What kind of shield is that you are oh, wielding? Oh my god, give it to me. Road, see? You're gonna have to hand over, say, 200 gold. 200 gold? Okay, I thought I was gonna pay the bounty, but screw that. Uh, let's persuade. Eh, fine. I can tell you aren't worth the trouble. Just get out of here before I change my mind. Oh, oh, if I find out that I can take you easily, that shield is mine. I'm thinking about it. What do you guys think? A lucky shot? The, a haze envelops the surrounding pines. Ooh. Alright, well let's... If we're gonna take a pot shot, we need to be where she can't see us. You know, realistic-like. Oh, look! We've disappeared! Huh, where did that adventurer go? Oh, dear! Huh, well, he must have gone around the corner. Must be gone now. Yeah, yeah, totally. Really? You don't see me. Oh my god, I am so not stealthy. Who sees me? What sees me? I like the fog, by the way. Fog is new. We like the fog. Oh, for the love of Christ. You don't see me. I disappear. I step in the shadows. That's an amp guard thing for those of you that might know. Oh, oh, I think we got it. I think we got it. Yeah! You cooking that pot. I'm gonna get you right in your butt. Oh, oh God! Oh, you didn't see that. That didn't happen. God bless America. Scoochie, 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 scoochie. My shield. Yeah! My shield! <laughs> Oh god, and I just went chaotic. <laughs> oh god, nobleman shield. Woo, look, it's so pretty. And look at that value. Oh yes. Um, everything else you have. Oh, Nordic be bear, bear dax? Huh. I might like to see Lydia uh, wield that, but that's later. And we sneak away so that none of the other bandits in the tower know that we did it. Oh, a mysterious foe as I skulk away into the fog of the night. <laughs> I love it. Okay, I think we can stop sneaking now. That was cool. That was pretty cool. Oh, I'm going to have to split this into so many episodes. I don't even know how long I've been recording anymore. It's going to take so long to get to Riften. But that was just really fun. That was just really fun, except for the part where I, I, I know I'm skipping a lot of plants. Trust me, you can, you can fill up on just plants on the way there. Roadside plants is just so much, so much. And I've been using my bow specifically, uh, you know, because I don't have any ranged magicka right now. Uh, except for, like, Conjure Familiar, and he's weak. Uh, it's literally, Conjure, Conjure Familiar is a basic wolf. You're conjuring the wolves that I've been putting down with a single arrow. It's the same thing. So it's just too doggone weak. And I hope that that doesn't bother you guys out there watching where it's like, No! You're supposed to be a mage! You're muddling it all up! It's all destroyed now, it's all asymmetrical garbage! You know, I, I like to dabble in a lot of different things. Actually, to tell you the honest truth, whenever I play Skyrim or Oblivion or any Elder Scrolls game, I try as hard as I possibly can not to dabble. I don't, and I know there's an outcropping of uh, metal there, but do I even have a pickaxe? I don't think I do. Nope. Anyway, um, I will get a pickaxe later, definitely. Uh, hey, you detect me, don't you? Not for long. Oh, I should have let him keep detecting me. Anyway. Um, I try as hard as I can not to dabble, uh, because I like to have pure characters, but th that's when I have multiple accounts, you know what I mean? On here, I'm pretty much just rocking the one account. What the... Will that wolf stop being... What are you doing, wolf? I just want to take you down. Jump, th th there he is. Hold on, flames. Magic. Oh, I should have hit my, um... I should have hit my uh, favorites instead. Yeah, burn, baby, burn. Disco Inferno. <laughs> A little bit of destruction magic level progress there. So many freaking wolf pelts. 
I just want to get to. I just want to get to ri uh, Riften, is it? Oh boy. I am having a time. On here, I just have the one account mainly because it's all being recorded, you know? So I don't have a lot of time that I can bounce back and forth between multiple characters. I mean, I suppose I could, but these episodes, ooh, when they get long, they get really long. I like the fog. I love the fog. Volumetric fog. Iverstead. Solitude. Windhelm. Riften. That's where we need to go. Yes, indeedy. I will meet you at either A, the next encounter, or B, Riften. So I'll stop the recording here. Hey everybody, how's life treating you? I'm Russ Robo, and uh, actually, why am I why am I doing the whole intro? Anyway, we're back. You haven't missed a thing. I finally made it to Riften. I won't lie, I actually did try to map travel there. You can't fast travel to it. I hadn't discovered it yet. So I had to walk the entire way, but we finally made it. And I'm going to find I out... I know his name. His name is Inargo. I... or Inigo. Uh, I'm Black not sure I'm pronouncing back. it right. I like Once Inigo. I don't know you. Personally. You and Riften looking for trouble? Just passing through. Yeah? Well, I got news for you. There's nothing to see yeah. here. Last thing the Black Briars need is some stranger sticking their nose where it doesn't belong. Uh, Black Briar... I don't even want to ask him about that. Pocket, and the I'm here to get my followers. Back, so keep your nose out of their business. Whatever. Me, I'm Maul. I watch the streets for them. If you need dirt on anything, I'm your guy. But it'll cost you. Hmm. Persuade. Then you're stupider than you <laughs> look. You better watch your ass around here. <laughs> I wanted to do persuade in order to increase my speech craft. So every now and again it works. I probably should have had to pay him, but I'm not interested in that. I'm really getting tired of your excuses. When you borrowed the money, you said you'd pay it back on time and for double the. Oh God, there's so much going on here. So much going on. But I just need to know where. I just need to get to the jail cells. Next time, keep your plans quiet and nothing happens. Uh, the prisoner jail cells. Where were those again? Now that I think about it, I haven't been locked up in Riften in so long I can't even hardly remember. I think it's over here to the left or to the right. Mr. Bale Keep, yeah. Yep, Rift in Jail. Oh, and the dogs were freaking out earlier. If it happens again, I apologize. I'm just going to go right into the jail. Um, uh, hopefully I won't get in trouble. <laughs> Aw, she pretty. We'll have to dismiss her, though, because I've got my new follower I'm thinking about. You're not going to tell me I can't go in there, are you? Oh, Christ. Are you serious? Hey, you're not supposed to be down here. Official business only. Yeah, I got official business. Uh... Sure. There we go. That'll do just fine. Go on ahead. Yeah, yeah. Gotta grease the hinges every now and again. I didn't want to risk persuasion in that one. This is actually really important to me. What is this? Crazy Khajiit? Oh, maybe it's him. Okay. Important. The crazy Khajiit in cell one is not to be disturbed. He paid us good money for that cage, so don't go bothering him. If he's still here in a month, I think we should enforce a little rent increase. I doubt we'll get the chance, though. You've all seen the way he looks. Won't be surprised if he tries to end his life soon. If you see him in a particularly suicidal mood, get in there and stop him. He's been using the key we gave him, so if you need in there in a hurry, use the spare in the broken strong box above the fireplace. A dead man can't pay rent. Okay, so they let you know how to get him out of there in case you can't lock, in case you don't have any uh, lock picks left. So it says, um, spare key in the broken strong box above the fireplace. Spare key in the broken strong box above the fireplace. Okay, ah, hey, there it is. Broken strong box. In our go cell, in I go cell key. No, awesome, and now you see how to get him. I was gonna steal some food, but the guard's watching me. <gasps> oh, I should steal it. I should take it. I should take it. Can the guard see me? Yeah, he can totally see me. He's totally watching me. He 
these totally. Just I, I can't fence items anyway, unless I start doing that kind of thing. Let me know what you guys think. Should I just start doing stuff like that? Huh. That ain't him, is it? It doesn't look like him. Or it kind of does. He's just awfully purple. Age doesn't mean you have to stay in yours, Mr. Dragonfly. Yeah, that's him. He's nuts. Are the guards going to get mad if I unlock his cell? I'm, I'm kind of going to do it. I'm definitely going to do it. Maybe I should talk to the guard first. Hey. Hey, you. Hey, you. The Greybeards have summoned the Dragonborn. To uh, whatever. Guard. That's storyline that stuff. You keep talking. You just Hundreds keep... Go, go about your business. Go about your business. You don't see me. You don't see me about to do this. Hey, Anargo, let's talk. You need some armor. Come to kill me at the last, have you? Thank the gods. I can bear the guilt no longer. I know I must die. Beware, though. My newfound honor demands I defend myself. Hmm. I am in no mood for jokes. Strike me down. Take your revenge. Huh. You don't remember? Uh, that is my fault also. I am your so-called friend, Inigo. I was the one who killed you. I tried anyway. I am guilty. Kill me. Hmm. <laughs> After I shot you, I finally realized my mistake and tried to turn myself in. Your body was gone. The guards did not believe me. They said I was wasting their time. I had to pay them to put me in this cell. It is where I belong. I needed to repent. I need to repent. Interesting. If you thought I was dead, then why are you here waiting for me? Hmm. Uh, we could skip ahead, but... There we go. I heard tales I of a more. remarkable adventurer, both brave <clears throat> and resourceful, matching your description. I knew it was you. It had to be. I knew you would be coming for me, so I waited. Are you going to kill me or not? Nope. I like his voice. Uh, I don't remember what happened. We j he just told us what happened. You, uh, you owe me. Come with me. I fight with you. <gasps> I can't. I haven't discussed. I haven't dismissed Lydia yet. Oh wait. Uh, he doesn't count to the uh, towards the traditional follower count. You can't have him and another. But I don't want to, because that's that's cheesing it. Yes, Inigo. Repay your debt with the blood of my foes. Or die defending you. Yes, I accept. I feel lighter in my heart now you have given me this opportunity. It will be like old times. Yay! <laughs> Do not joke about such things, my friend. The sadness I feel for what I have done is brutal enough. For now... Alright, alright. Uh, you need armor and weapons. So where... We, we need to buy him some stuff. Lydia, uh, I, I know... Uh, let me know what you guys think in the comment section, but I think I should just go with Anigo. Uh, two followers is just a bit much. Uh, until later on. Hello, until, Lydia. Um, we have not been properly introduced yet. My name is Inigo. Oh. Hello? Where are you? Over here. I am the blue thing talking to you. The blue thing? Oh, hi. It's very nice to meet you. Likewise. Are you feeling okay? You seem distracted. Um... What were we talking about? I was just saying, you seem a bit distracted. I am. I've got some fresh cabbage. I'm thinking of making some apple cabbage stew. Uh, okay. I will leave you to your thoughts. Maybe I'll do turnips next. Hmm. Or maybe radishes? Okay, maybe I, I hope shouldn't. Her sword arm works better than her head. Sheesh. Why, you. 
Okay, I have to stop them for a minute. It's it's getting it's getting salty. Like, wow, oh, the salt is real. <laughs> I hope her sword arm works better than her head. Oh my god. Okay, maybe I can't get rid of Lydia yet. Um, they have interactions. I like that. I like that. Um, I've got a better idea. I'll just increase the game difficulty. Um, where's where's the uh, settings? Gameplay. Uh, let's see. It's on default right now. Adapt. Expert. There's Master and then Legendary, so I think Expert is what we'll go with now. Yeah, yeah. Legendary is the highest. Expert is what we'll go with now. And then if I, as I continue to level up, around about 20, 20 25, we'll increase it again. Or however it needs. Yes, that's good. So we finally have an Igo. I just need to get him arms and armor. So uh, let's go buy some stuff for him, because he got nothing. I have a bow he could use already. Let's see. Well, let's go buy him some stuff real quick, and then I'll, I'll we'll we'll end off the episode there. It's so good. I'm just I I, I had no idea they would have interactions when they um, built that character for the mod. They must have anticipated <coughs> other followers. Oh, for the love of Christ! Everything's closed. Ah, oh, I need an inn. Need to go to an inn, sleep for the night, wait for the shops to open, and then, um, and I could just auto wait, like the wait button, but again, I feel like that's cheesing it, and I don't like to cheese it. Oh, um, I got some more gold. There was a kaiji caravan trader right outside of Riften, and, uh, I sold off some of my things and bought some new People things and made a lot of gold. Heed I have about words. a thousand now. The return of the dragons is not mere coincidence. And the dogs are gonna freak this out again. This is one of the signs. The signs that Lady Mara is displeased with your constant inebriation. Put down your flagons filled with your vile liquids, and embrace the teachings of the Handmaiden of Kine. No, no, Marumal. We talked about this. Talon? <sighs> Certainly we can come to some sort of an understanding. These people must be made aware of the chaos they've sown. Enough, Marumal. We've all heard of the dragons and their return. There's no need hmm. to use them as an excuse to harass our customers. Very well, Talon. I'll remove myself from this den of iniquity. We're not kicking you out. <laughs> Just keep the sermons at the temple and let us all sin in peace. If you've got the coin, you've come to the right place. Pull up a seat. Okay. Um, that was something I hadn't heard before, so I stopped to listen to it. If you've got the coin, you're welcome here. Otherwise, hit the road. I need a... Dang, hit the road. Jeez. They're all about money in, in Riften. Of course. She is such a raptor. Look at her. Um, let's see. You like to rent a room? Sure thing. It's yours for a day. All right. Never done an honest day's work in your life for all that coin you carry. Alas. Did you steal my gold? I'm saying you've got the coin, but you didn't earn a septum of it honestly. I did! I can tell. Oh, God. He wants me to be a thiefy thief. It's all about sizing up your mark, lass. The way they walk, what they're wearing. It's a dead giveaway. Come on, I got a kaijit right over there, and he's not wearing a friggin' thing. <laughs> oh, but that's where you're wrong, lass. Wealth is my business. Maybe you'd like a taste. I've got a bit of an errand to perform, but I need an extra <sighs> pair of hands. Exhausting. And in my line of work, extra hands are well paid. Simple. I'm going to cause a distraction. You're gonna steal Medesi's silver ring from a strong box <clears throat> under a stand. No, I'm not. Once you have it, I want you to place it in Branche's pocket without him noticing. Maybe later. There's someone that wants to see him put out of business permanently. That's all you need to know. I'll be out in the market all day, from 8 in the morning until 8 in the evening. Hmm. Meet me then, if you've still got the stomach for it. Uh, uh, do. I'll be at the market come morning. Oh god, did they add that? You better be there too. Whatever. I'm going to my room. I've got to get, I've, I've got to wait for the friggin' sun to rise and all the shops to open so I can get Inigo some clothes because he's running around butt-ass naked. 
All right, you guys wait here. 2 a.m., 3 a.m., 4 a.m., 5 a.m., 6 a.m., 7 a.m., 8 a.m., 9 a.m., uh, 10 a.m., just to make sure. Eight hours of sleep is always good. And again, I didn't eat before bed, so I won't wake up hungry. Because uh, apparently when you sleep, it counts as waiting, and the eight hours is counted in real time, so you always wake up hungry and thirsty. <clears throat> okay, now I'm no longer... I'm hungry and thirsty. Okay, but I'm no longer tired. Food. Just eat some bread. <laughs> oh, God. That's such not a good... At, at all. At all. No. I'm going to drink two of those, and we're hydrated. So now we're... We're fed and watered, like a plant. And she was coming to tell me that my room's available. <laughs> as soon as I get him into some clothes... Let me know if there's anything else well, you uh, need. <laughs> let me know if there's anything else you need after I just slept the entire night. Um, what, do you, what do you call it? Yes, armor, armor. Um, we'll end the episode off there as soon as I get him some stuff he can wear. Balamund, my Come favorite blacksmith. Balamund perform miracles with steel, eh? Smithing's been in my blood for generations. I owe my success to my forefathers and their recipe for flame. The secret is my forge. It consumes fire salts, a strange mineral that burns as hot as red mountain lava. Cool. Well, it was. Sadly, this forge is dying, and I've used the last of my fire salts. If I can't feed it soon, it may grow cold. You will? Thank you. Ten pinches of fire salt should give me all I need to bring this forge back to life. Sweet. Uh, no training in smithing just yet. I need to save my money for um for weapons and apparel. I don't have any armor. It says he deals well in both light and heavy armor. But um, since Lydia's already in heavy armor, I'm going to get him some light armor if I can. Uh, hide is pretty low. I should make it myself. Yeah, I should custom make it. Okay, miscellaneous. We need... We need leather, first of all. And strips. Uh, that should be all we need. For now. Because uh, that's going to be... Leather is going to be higher than hide, right? Ooh, Remember, but I can't nothing build... nothing but genuine fire salts will do. The forge mm. knows the difference. Shoot. We can't build both light and heavy armor because we can't go I could go okay pause we can't go both light armor and heavy armor in smithing we can but that would be a waste of a lot of points so I need to pick a path I think heavy armor I'm thinking heavy armor because if him and Lydia are both in heavy armor they could be really powerful tanks Actually, I could go light armor, because even if I go light armor, I can still increase the like strength of a heavy armor. Like I can still, um, I can still, or can I? Yeah, heavy armor. Dang it. Okay, blacksmith forge. Oh, I know how that works. We gotta go heavy armor, so he's gonna need some iron. That's as high as we can make, I believe, or is it studded? That's light armor. Iron ingots. Oh, we don't have any iron ingots. I forgot to buy the iron ingots. Do do do. I haven't put anything in smithing yet, so I guess I can just pick whatever I want. Purchase. Uh, that for sale. Hmm. Blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit your needs. I've got ten minutes. Let's get this going. Iron. Whew. Wait, what? Oh God, I don't have enough. Uh, what can I sell to you? Potions. Oh no, I can't sell him potions. Shoot. I'll have to pick which ones I want. How many can I buy? If, uh, da -da 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 -da. I can buy a decent amount. And... Oof. God, two gold. Remember, nothing but genuine fire salts will do. The forge knows mm. the difference. Let's make him some hide. Oh boy, I hope I have enough. We'll start him off and hide. Reminds me what I. Oh, am I gonna run out? Uh, no, no, I won't. I won't. Okay. Now let's make. Wait, wait. Armor 25. Uh oh, I think I made up. Yeah, I messed up. You do studded for the basic armor, and then the rest is hide. 
Or is it leather? Oh look, she's warming her hands. Near God, she's warming her hands. The fire's over here. Oh God. Um, let's check six, six, eleven. Okay, what about leather? It's higher, isn't it? Eight, eight, eight. Yeah, yeah, it's it's higher. So leather. I I need to um, what? Battery exhausted. I forgot to charge the camera. Crap. Okay. Well, face cam's off. It's all right. I'm just doing regular mundane crap anyway. Tanning rack. Yes, I know how the tanning rack works. Fur plate. Who's fur plate? What? Let's make one. Hide lace. Okay, we've got one of each of those. Find out what those do. Uh, leather. That's what I need. From the put uh, from the pelts. Leather strips. Requires leather. So we get all of the leather we can. Good thing I got all those wolf kills and pelts. Then we get all the water skins we need. Okay, oh, we've got five leather left. We don't want to use it all on straps. Uh, oh no, uh, big guy, I need your forge. Like right now. Okay, let, give him time to step away. There we go. Oh god, and now we're making stuff to him. Uh, we gotta go back to leather. Uh, we got the boots. We need the bracers. And the helmet. Ooh, cell sword shoes. Spell sword shoes? Uh, no. Are those for me? Oh, interesting. Maybe I should make the rest of the spell sword stuff later. Building materials? No. Miscellaneous? Oh my god, an animal collar. Why? Why is there. Ooh, black mage arm guards. Yes! Black mage boots. Okay, arm guards. And then, no! What's this focusing gem? Hot dog. I'll make the rest of the Black Mage stuff as soon as I can. Uh, what else can I make right now? Leather. Ooh, what? Black Mage college robes. Yay! Oh, new stuff, new stuff. That's right, new stuff. Ooh, Black Mage. I can go heavy armor. I can be the Black Mage in heavy armor. How do you like it? I know people will like it. Hammer, iron armor. Uh, that'll sell for the most. It's also the heaviest, but it'll sell for the most. Uh, and then just make a bunch of daggers, because they use the least amount of materials. Then I really got to get to selling after I fully equipped my boy. In I go. No matter the weather, Riften always smells lovely. It is a good place to start a new adventure. Yes, yes it is. But I need to give you some things. Pooling our resources. Interesting. Oh my god, he's got equipment. And some serious equipment, too. You got some serious hardware there, my boy. Ebony bow already? Oh, enables Inigo loading screens when in Inigo's inventory. Oh, cool. Inigo cell key, lock picks, potion of vigorous healing. Let's leave that on him. Okay, so literally all he needs is the armor. Apparel. Let's see. Why Do I give or equip or... Oh, I equipped it. Excellent. Black mage, those are for me. Fine boots, gloves, hide armor. Let's see. Da, 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 da. No, that was the weak one. Well, he needs leather and studded. I, I made a mistake and made hide by accident. Okay, so leather. Uh, X is give. 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 Uh, I don't know if I want him to have the helmet. I, li I like his face without the helmet. And actually... Wouldn't leather be higher than studded armor? Oh well, we'll figure it out. Oh god, he looks funny. I might put him in heavy armor later on. Uh, let's take the helmet off. He just looks funny. Uh, let's see, take. <laughs> yeah, I'll put him in some better armor soon. Alright, alright. Now what am I wearing? I'm all equipped in the right stuff, right? Okay, I've got my backpack on. I'm warming my hands in the wrong direction. <laughs> Exit warming hands, please. Thank you. Okay. Uh, let's see. Oh God! In our in I go. I need to I need to sell. Yes, my friend. Blast it. What's next? I need to sell all this extra stuff. Got to get my money back, or at least some of it. Cause boy, I went broke. Look at that. Two gold. Nay, nay. Uh, sell. 
Sell, sell, sell. Hide laces, hide shield, uh, yeah. Iron armor, iron armor, iron dagger, iron dagger. Uh, I need to disenchant those. Uh, keep that, sell that, keep that, sell that. All right, that's all the things we can give to him. Remember, nothing but genuine fire salts will do. The forge knows the difference. Okay, well, uh, we finally got our new follower, Inigo. He's going to help us out. I'm probably going to get some heavy Learn armor or better armor for him after a while. Uh, I just need to know his fighting style, what all he's like. I imagine he's going to be somewhat like uh, an archer sort of rogue type. Um, and that's not me stereotyping. That just seems the way it's going to be. Uh, but um, he's going to do pretty good. Right after this, um, in the next episode, what we are going to do is this. Uh, we're going to find the necromancer and the strange creatures so I can start resurrecting my army of undead skeletons. But anyway, that's all the time I have left for today. I literally have to be at work in about an hour. So I hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to subscribe for updates on future content. Leave any helpful comments you might have in the comment section below. Likes are always appreciated. Until next time, take it easy, my friends.